Hello team, we are back, Vegetarian Minecraft. So, last episode I found a village, which you may recall. I was very pleased about that. Made my way back here with my various loots. Uh, those loots being specifically um, some, you know, potatoes, some cocoa beans, some, some carrots, some cacti. This other pumpkin I found. That's pretty cool. Also had a, about 10 iron I got out of the blacksmith chest. And so I made a sword and a pick out of that. So, excited about that. And on the way back, I spotted something I've only seen maybe three, actually no, exactly three times now in Minecraft. So I'm going to go show you what it is. When I get back, I'm going to plant some more pumpkins out here. That'll be fun. Oh, and real quickly, I'll show you, I was checking out my eggs when I got back, and I did a little bit of uh, creeper excavation. Uh, completely intentionally, I assure you, I totally wanted this giant crater on the side of my hill. Okay, so, see, see that? See that? That squid, he just he just drowned, for no reason. Do uh, you see this? Do you see this floating boat? This happened earlier. I think that happens when squid run into it. All right, so come on, boat, come on, almost almost there. So I made this boat on the way back in the middle of the night. Um, it's like I bet I can sail back home, and I could. So uh, it's actually not too difficult to get to where I want to go. It's not very hard. I thought maybe I'd build the nether portal to get over there, but it really may not be far enough away to justify building an entire portal. And honestly, well, I'd have to build a bunch of buckets and lug a bunch of lava around, and that's not fun. Look, a creeper party over there. Oops, there they go. Okay, so, let's see, where was I? Um, I go to this landmark here, which is this, you know, this little desert hill. And then I turn this direction, which I think, let me see where the moon is. Hello, moon. I think, am I going south? I think the clouds are moving north. All right, anyway, a uh, little swamp business. I need to go around the swamp or through it. I think around. We'll see. We'll see. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Oh, wow, look. Oh, wait. I can see underground a little bit. I want to see real quick. Uh, see if I can... I don't know. I guess I see lava under there. That's cool. It looked like it might be a little uniform, so I thought maybe it was a stronghold, but... I won't be surprised, folks, if there's a stronghold in here somewhere. Alright. So, let's see if I can just carefully go around these lily pads. Yeah, so far, so good. I'm pretty sure... I might be getting a little bit... A little bit off course here, but I'm fairly certain. But it's through here. Yeah, there we go. There's that desert I was talking about. Now, I marked my place. Ah, good. Perfect. I marked my place with some torches, so you could see. And really, it's right It's right through here. It's right between this, this jungle, where I found the cocoa beans, and this little desert outcrop in here. Oh, look. Skeleton. Can I get... Can I do a zoom by? Hmm. Oh, yeah. There's the crafting table I built. When I needed to uh, build a boat. Alright. I think this will be good. I can walk from here. Alright. So. Uh, I've only ever seen these things in deserts. And I think it's obvious. Why. Um, let's see. Alright. Got a spider on one side. Clowns to the left of me. Jokers to the right. Alright. Here I am. Yep. Alright. I don't want to fight you in water. What am I thinking? Come to me. And you also come to me. You too shall be the one who, to me, must travel. Oh, also, oh, know what I forgot to do? Bring all the wool I was going to bring with me to trade back in the village. Well, I'll make a journey again. Probably cut out all the boring bits so you don't have to watch that, but I'm definitely going to go back to the village and trade some wool with them. Woo! Oh, hey, man. Ah, oh, man, there's skeletons everywhere. Ow! Take this. Take that. Man, I wish I had a diamond sword. That'd be so much better than this. I mean, iron's good. Don't get me wrong. I shouldn't complain. It's free iron. Found it in somebody's house and just took it. So, really, don't really have any cause to complain. I certainly didn't work for it. Unless you call walking a long distance working. Which, you know, in some cases... Anyway, anyway I, I, am, I am running on at the mouth. Alright, here we go. Ah, perfect. There it is. I'm take out these spiders. 
Hello. Ow, ow. You can't kill me, though. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Done. Problem solved. Spiders defeated. Check this out. This is a, an accident the way it spawns. Yeah, <laughs> dungeon spawns here. Underground. And then the sand... The sand all falls in. So, so that's pretty fun. So we're gonna we're gonna dig in there and see what kind of spawner we got. And I am hopeful, folks. I am hoping that it will be a skeleton spawner. And then, well, then we'll have arrows for days. And I, I hear kind of a, a rattling, so I'm thinking maybe, maybe it is a skeleton spawner. We're just gonna hope. We're gonna hope and get lucky. All right, let's take a look. And should be some mossy cobblestone down here. And that's great fun. All right. Let's see. I do love mossy cobblestone. So there should be a chest here and a spawner here. That's that's my assumption. Yeah, okay, there's the chest. Uh, oh, look, a saddle. Oh, good, I can raise pigs and maybe ride around on a pig for fun. Uh, let's see. Do, do, do. It looks like a pig spawner. What? Why does that look like a pig spawner? Um... Well, I know that can't be right. Alright, now the good news is, it's far too bright. They'll never... They'll never spawn this level of light during the day. So really what I should do is just take that away. Oh, hey! Yep, it looks like it's probably a skeleton spawner. Ah, oh, sweet. I don't know why it shows a pig in there. It's, it's pretty crazy. Let's clear out some of this. Is there anything on the other side of this? No. Nah. Yeah. Hmm. And I don't think there's gonna be another chest anywhere. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure we've seen them all now. All right. Well, that was fun. Now, what am I gonna do about this? Ugh, there we go. There is all of this, and I could make a trap here. I could make a skeleton trap, and then then I'd have arrows for days. All right. I'm gonna take this off. I'm going to give skeletons a chance to spawn here whenever they want. And what I'm going to do now is go back home, grab some wool, head off to the village over there, and then, you know, trade trade for some other stuff. All right, so when you see me again, that's where I will be. All right, I'm back getting my boat here. I've realized I can... Whoop, whoop, turn around. I've realized there's a much more direct route to my village with the boat. Don't even have to turn over there. Just should pretty much be able to go straight this way. And that will be easy. I'm gonna go around this. So you'll see here, I uh, have a bed in my hotbar there, and I'm going. I'm bringing that with me because I want to uh, make sure I can change the sun when I get to the village. I don't want to, uh, you know, have my entire village wiped out by zombies just because I'm there doing business. I don't really think that's fair to them, you know. So uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to avoid that by bringing a bed with me. And it'll be one of those occasions where I actually do use a bed. I, I like I like not using a bed. It's kind of freeing. You know, it's just kind of the the uh, the, the sun goes down, the moon comes out, that sort of thing. You know, get to work in the dark. It keeps it exciting. You know, creepers coming up on you. You know how it is. So, let's see. Here we go. Jungle should be coming in view soon. There you go. And there's a nice little river here. I'm going to try to head up. Hopefully not crash into the shore too hard. Uh, let's see. So you can see the dungeons can be over there. Ah, oh, here we go. Can we do it? Can we? Can we? Yes! We're doing it. This is going to be a little tighter. Ah, oh, no! We can't do it! Ow! Ow! Ah! Alright, that was, that was too tight. That was too tight. Alright, had to break a little earlier to take the, t the turn there, and I did not. So let that be a lesson to you about reckless driving. Okay. So I believe it should just be this way. Pretty much straight this way. Um Do you remember was I were, were you with me when I found the the wolves on the way back from here in the tundra? I was super excited about those wolves. I'm not sure if you were there with me when that happened, but it did happen. So so that's pretty cool. Um yeah, I think if I just if I get out here and walk a little bit it should be there. And you know, this might be long enough to justify building a nether, nether portal, you know? I don't know if I... Ooh, underwater enchantment. Okay. 
Let's see, should be right over these hills. Yes! Oh, desert. You're so much fun. I Someday I want to do a large biome hardcore survival, uh, which would be fun. The only problem is if you spawn in the desert or ocean, you pretty much just need to start over again. If you start in a large desert biome on hardcore, uh, you are going to die. It, you know, I, just, I just don't think it's possible to, to live through that. I mean, I think, I think if you run, just, you straight up just run, I'm not sure you'll find any sort of food in time. Right? I'm not sure you can even get out of the desert before you starve to death. Um, same thing with, with the ocean. You have to swim a very long ways, and, and swimming is very slow, and there aren't going to be any trees in the ocean. That's something you can usually count on. So, But in any case, that's not what we're doing. We're here in the desert. I try to trade some wool with the friendly local villagers claim one of these homes as my own um hmm i think this one had grass growing in it and that seems i don't want that that's stupid uh this is nice though all right all right just gonna get up this ladder here we go we'll set up here Ta-da! okay that'll be our place we'll leave the downstairs for people who want to hide in there there are no doors on this business though I wonder if there were at one point. And zombies came by. They shouldn't have. Hello. Yeah, so you, you're the stupid person with a terrible deal for me. Move on my way, sir. Hello. Good sir. Oh, wait, you need... You're the arrow guy. Okay, where's the wool guy? Are you... Are you a wool guy? You are one of the wool guys. Alright, let's see. Thank you, sir. Put all these things in here. Yes. More. Ooh, wow. Straight out five emeralds. You gonna change your mind about me now? Yeah, you thinking about it. Ooh. Uh, okay, so 16 wool for that. Uh, oh, wow. Wolf. <laughs> emeralds for cooked chicken. I'm sorry, sir, but I am a vegetarian. I have no use for your tender meats. Uh, let's see. Where did I lock everybody else? Hello. You are the bottle of enchanting. That's right. Don't need you yet, but I'm gonna leave you there. Um, because I'm going to want you. Let's see. Yeah, I want to lock these guys in again real quick. Hello. Okay, so... Yes. Will you take any old wool? You will. Sweet. Alright, how about you think about this? What do you think about me now? What do you think of me now, champ? I'm like, oh, wow, you, you just sold me a bunch of wool. I like that about you. Yes, I like that about you. Whoa. Where are you going, man? Dude, chill, chill, dude, d dude. Hey, okay, you gotta, you gotta calm down, man. You gotta calm down. What? This is, dude. This is lame. That's what this is. This is lame. Oh man. All right. Well, let me get some more emeralds. There we go. Will this, will this work? No, because you, you need them all to be the same type. What the, what the? Why are you so mad, man? Why are you so mad? You... What? You were angry. I've never seen them angry before. Oh, it's getting dark. I better, uh... Lock them up for their own safety. Uh, let's see. Where's my bed? Where's my bed? Sorry, guys. I know, again, it seems inhumane, right? But they, they can't take care of themselves. That's just how they are. Oh, that's a lot of light. Alright, come on. Gotta get up here and sleep before the zombies come and eat them all. Just don't want that. Don't want them all to get eaten. All right. Okay. Well, oh, look. Some monsters did spawn. I think this might be it, folks. This might be all I need to do for today. Uh, here in the village. Which I should probably name. Um, don't want to, though. Not right now. Ah, now you. You will give me arrows. Yes. Look at that. 50 arrows, guys. He's like, oh, you know what? You're great. Oh, am I? What other deals do you have for me, good sir? You cooked fish. I can't... I can't do this. I can't get you fish. They're non-hostile. I can't just go pull them out of the river. Hmm. Well, that may be roughly the extent of what we can accomplish in that village. Was there anything in there? No. 
Hmm. Although it may have served its purpose. I have arrows. I can come back here for arrows at some point. I don't know if eventually he'll just be like, no, man, no more arrows for you. Give me some cooked fish, because I don't... I don't want to do that. Man, where are you going? This is... Oh, yeah, gravel, dude. I don't want to even talk to you. All right, well, uh, good good adventure. Thanks, everyone, for sticking around. I'm glad you uh, glad you saw all that. Hope you enjoyed my interactions with those villagers. I'm going to head on home. going to plant some pumpkins. going to do some gardening. And maybe that's what I'll be doing next time, uh, next time I come back. I figure I'll either be gardening... Um, or I will be, um, building that tower up maybe again. Might build up that tower now. I might have to go back in the nether, um, off camera and do some more strip mining of that nether fortress. Maybe build a portal out to here. I will need to find some lava though. Or just find some diamond. Man, I have a lot of off camera work to do folks. So either strip mining or just caving for diamond. That sort of thing. If you're interested in seeing me cave, let me know and I'll you know, record some of that. Otherwise, I'm just going to leave that stuff off camera and preserve the mystery. And where did I put that boat? Ah, there it is. Ahoy, boat. Alright, um, floating boat. There we go. Now, you want your boats to float. That is, of course, their main function. But not in air. I don't know why that even happens. I'm not even sure why that happens. Do 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 sailing on a boat. Sailing on a boat. Doom 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 Alright. Let's see if I can get through this turn now. You know what, this is all B-roll anyway.